And presidential elections also took place in Guatemala. Comedian turned politician Jimmy Morales of the National Convergent Front swept the elections with close to 70% of the vote. Now his election comes as the former president, of course, Otto Perez Molina and his former vice president, Roxana Valdetti, are in jail, accused of corruption. Morales says he will represent all Guatemalans, including those who live outside of the country. However, the turnout in the election was down sharply compared with the first round. From the presidency, I will be able to serve 50 million of Guatemalans inside the national territory and 2 million in the United States, who also supported us on this occasion. And Morales' rival, Sandra Torres, she recognized, the, so she recognized the triumph of Morales. I am and always will be a Democrat. We recognize Mr. Jimmy Morales' victory and we wish him success for the sake of Guatemala. As always, we offer our constructive support for the sake of the country, since the current situation is a very complex one, which will need important agreements to move on. Guatemala has serious problems, but the people have made its choice, which we respect, and we wish Mr. Morales the best of success.